Today we've got a simple project to make the most of your photos. Whether you've got some great snaps of a city or landscape you've visited, a few of your favourite baby photos, or something entirely unique, this piece of wall art will show them off with stylish use of typography and colour. You're going to need some coloured card or paper, a template for your letters, a selection of photos, some glue, scissors, ruler and a pencil, and a photo frame. We're using an A4 frame which makes the sizing really simple, though you could be more adventurous. Create your letter template on the computer. You'll want to use a bold font such as Arial Black and make the letters big enough to fill the frame with a small border. If your frame is bigger than your printer paper size, then simply print each letter separately. There's full instructions for a larger project in the book. Start by cutting out the letters on your colour card. We're scoring along the straight lines and cutting around the curves. If you have any letters with a central section, such as our D, then cut the middle piece out and save for later. Next, you need to position your photos so that your favourite bits show through the letters. We're using a photo for each letter, that you could create a collage. Cut to size and glue into place on a sheet of paper, the same size as your frame. Also, glue on any middle pieces from your letters. Then, simply put the art into the frame. Letters first, then the photo sheet, and secure with the back piece. Turn it over and there you have it. We've gone for a classic black, white and red colour scheme for our London picture. Now you can theme your piece however you like. How about this stunning yellow New York piece from the book? Thanks for watching, we hope this has inspired you to make something really unique to display your photos. For more crafty ideas, we'd love you to sign up to make. See you next time.